Hey guys, hey guys, hey guys. Yeah, I'll let, I'll leave my vacuum out because constantly got a vacuum, hand is shedding again, even worse than ever. So I uh, stretch now, I do daily stretches. I have been working, doing workouts on the floor. So vacuum, vacuum, vacuum. So um, let's talk about the, uh, let's talk about these Snapchat question things that Emily Reed is putting on. I didn't even know she was doing this. And because I go on Snapchat, I actually, uh, nowadays people exchange snaps instead of phone numbers. So because people are always like, when you exchange phone numbers, they disappear. So I never put people's phone numbers on my phone unless I know they're permanent in my life. Um, let's see. So I've been talking to the, this guy. Siri is getting on my nerves. I swear to goodness, I wish I could just, I'm just going to disable her because she doesn't do nothing for me anyway, but get on my nerves. Um, but I've been on there talking to him on and off since August. We met on a dating side cup. Do so every now and then. Um, we, I mean, we've been talking every day now, and and when I go in there, I see other people's stories on there, and I see Amberlynn Reed. I am subscribed to her so I can see her foolishness because all she loves taking pictures with filters. We all know that, but um. She's been doing these people and people on the ask some questions. And this is, this is something I have to talk about because this is what a narcissist thinks. This is their mentality. She's talking about, um, selling her nude, selling nudes to parts of her body for so much money. I would not pay a penny for a part of her body because obesity is not something that I'm attracted to. I don't like obesity on me. I don't find myself attractive. So why would I find somebody who's 600 pounds, 500 pounds, 400 pounds? Something I want, I need pictures of. If I was a man, I, I wouldn't want that. But feeders do. I guarantee somebody would pay that money. So she said that it's cheating if her girlfriend gets news from other chicks, okay? But it's not cheating for her to to give other strangers new pics of her because they're paying for it. It's not cheating. It is cheating because you're, it doesn't matter if you pay for it or not. It's cheating. It's, it's not something you should be profiting of. Okay. You don't want your girl. The reason why she don't want her girlfriend to get these from a, random girls is because she's insecure of herself. She's very insecure. She, she, you know, I don't believe anybody's with her for love. I really, truly don't. Who wouldn't want a free ride? Who wouldn't want to be with somebody who makes a ton of money? I'm sorry to say that, but I see insecurities in Amberlynn Reed. She's very insecure. She doesn't love herself. She, if she truly loved herself, number one, I wouldn't be, she wouldn't jump from relationship to relationship. She would stand on her own two feet. Number one. Number two, she wouldn't be obese. She would literally, in, se in the seven or eight years she's been on YouTube, she would have lost her weight. She could have lost her weight seven, eight times by now. Honestly, she could lose that weight. She doesn't try her weight. She profits off her, her, her weight. Okay. This is my, this is my opinion. If you don't like my opinion, you don't have to watch my opinion. Okay. You don't have to be talking about my opinion, but honestly, it's not cheating to her. If someone buys a picture of her, of her being nude, it's not cheating. Yes, it is cheating. If you're in a relationship, regardless if you sell them, Someone's still getting a picture of you nude. Someone is enjoying your picture of you being nude, whether they pay for it or not. But narcissists don't think like that. Oh, I'm being paid for it, so therefore it's not cheating. Girl, it's cheating one way or another, a person pays for it or not. That's the way I feel. If, if you guys don't like the, my opinion about it and the way I view it, you don't have to like it. You don't have to watch me. But the reason why I don't, and, and I hate when people call people who write your haters. I don't have nothing to hate about her. I can walk. I can do things. I'm enjoying my life. She is not. She's miserable. And, and she has to troll her body to make money because she can't be in the real world like the rest of us. So people that react to her are not haters. They're just giving their opinions. They are not sitting here throwing shade. And she always said that people who react to her are throwing shade. No. But the whole thing is, she is cheating if she even sells her picks, my opinion. So, 
but she's narcissistic. This is another way, another form of her being narcissistic because if it's about her, it's not wrong. If it's about her, her girlfriend, it is wrong. So if a girlfriend buys a nude from somebody else, that's not cheating. Girl, please, please check your mentality before you speak it because you sound really stupid. And a lot of people came back about that and they asked her, why is it cheating for your girlfriend, but not cheating for you? And a lot of a lot of you people are smart enough to figure that out. And I'm glad to see that. So let me know what you think, guys. I am back and I had to talk about this because I don't like narcissists. I've dated narcissists. And they will make your life a living hell if it's not about them. Okay? You guys, I'm glad I don't have anybody on my channel who's a, who is my new friend or been a current friend who has um, been my friend for a while now. You guys are not narcissists. And I love that about you guys. I love your opinions. I love you guys, period, because you guys are great people. And like I said, this is a form of her narcissism. And I don't know where she gets this mentality that if she gets paid for it, it's not cheating. Cheating, 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 right? So you guys have an amazing day. I'm going to talk to you guys. Hey, leave your opinions because I want to talk to you all you people that I love. Okay. Um, I don't know. I'm going to go by the flow. I used to film a lot every day. I got burned from that. I'm not going to lie. I think that's ugh, having COVID really did me in. But anyway, I love you guys. Let me know. I'll talk to you guys later.